Vanderbilt is looking to further develop its girls basketball program into a consistent winner and a recent uptick in participation has served as a healthy start. I stopped by the gym to see how the team feels about the early stages of its rise. The Waterville Panthers have seen a jump in girls basketball numbers. Last year, our last game, we had six suit up for us. Um, so, and on average, we only suited up eight all year. So that was a little tough, uh, particularly in practice. It's tough to practice with eight girls. You can't even play a five on five scrimmage. So this year, uh, we actually had 22 come out and now we have 18 in the program. A big part of their recruiting pitch was how playing basketball can help athletes in other sports. We recruited a lot <laughs> during soccer season. I was asking a bunch of girls on the team to play and a bunch of underclassmen that I didn't even know. And I was just like, you should come play basketball. Winter's like kind of an off season for most players. So with soccer and like track and stuff, Basketball gets you moving, gets you back in shape for those sports. Waterville has just one senior and no juniors on the varsity roster, so there's time to grow the team. I think they're capable of anything that they can put their mind to. I think that confidence is something that we struggle with a little bit, and once we get that up, we're going to be they're going to be on their way to the playoffs next year. Our rotation will probably grow in the next couple of years. We have six, I think, girls that really have the experience right now. So, but we've able to play, you know, 10 girls. And then when we're, you know, doing well, we can play all 12 and, and they get experience on the court, which is great. The Panthers are hopeful to secure a spot in state prelims. I think that'd be really big for us, especially with last year only winning two games and not even really having enough to play. It'd be really nice for my senior year to make it to the playoffs, you know, and I'm going to work really hard and I think the team is going to work really hard because I think it's something we all really want. Our goal kind of changed in the middle of the season. We're like, we want to get to a prelim game. So this end stretch here is going to mean a lot. Their upcoming battle of the bridge against Winslow will go a long way in determining if they make it. Coach Levine also credited junior high coaches for drumming up interest in basketball. He's looking forward to providing coaching continuity at the varsity level for the Panthers and even a spring and fall program. Waterville is in 13th place in Class B North and needs to reach the 11th spot for the prelims. This coming Friday's trip to Winslow is at 6.30 p.m.